So if you just pause for one minute and just imagine um, that a plane is about to crash, right? 250 children and babies. Um, if you knew how to stop that, would you? So the number of planes that we actually have crashing full of babies and children every single day is 60. 60 jumbo jets full of babies and children that never make it to their fifth birthday. 6.6 .6 million children never make it to their fifth birthday. And what's really sad about this um, is that we know what to do about it. Um, so diarrhea and pneumonia are among the top two killers of children under five. And uh, washing hands with soap can have a significant reduction of these diseases. Uh, hand washing with soap can reduce diarrhea by 50% and respiratory infections by a third. So hand washing with soap, which is a habit that we all take for granted, can have a huge impact in terms of reduction of these deaths and as well as keeping kids in school from, you know, keeping them from flus and eye infections um, that they regularly get in school. So what Lifeboy has done is Lifeboy has actually decided to um, set a mission of reaching and changing the behavior of one billion people by 2020 in terms of hand washing with soap in DNA countries. So far, since uh, 2010, we've reached 260 million in 24 countries. In South Africa alone, 5.2 million. So we've designed a school program that's called School of Five that basically talks about the five key occasions that one should be using soap. So basically before the main meals, breakfast, lunch and dinner, after the toilets and then taking a bath every day with soap. Um, and what we've done is we've created some fun characters to be able to start inducing a routine that is actually fun for the school children in South Africa. We also realize that obviously maternal mortality is still something that South Africa is struggling with. And um, the, the neonatal mortality, that is actually babies dying in the first 28 days of their lives. Um, so what we've done is we actually have a new moms program where we actually train health workers and then we train moms to introduce soap. At the moment, not only of deliveries, but also in the first 28 days of the life of a child, so that no baby is carried before until the, the hands are cleaned <laughs> and we don't uh, risk passing them infections that can make them extremely vulnerable, especially at this early age of, in, in their life. We've partnered with um, Mandini community um, where we can start seeing already hand washing with soap rates going up and um, diarrheal disease and infections going down. What we've seen is very simple. Wherever we've seen soap use increase, we've seen infections going down. And whilst it's uncomfortable for some to hear somehow um, uh, sales and life saved somehow equated in the same sentence, it is that business growth that's allowing us to be able to make those programs sustainable. The more we sell, the more we can do these programs. Um, so obviously we do tie up um, very clearly a sales angle to it because this is what will make the program more sustainable for us in the future. Um, Lifeboy is growing in South Africa and we intend to continue doing more for populations in South Africa.